Good morning, Idaho 516 on your Monday morning. We're still seeing some scattered showers outside right now. Those are going to continue into this afternoon before finally drying for the first time in what feels like three years, but I think it's only been about three days. Uh, we will see some sunshine tonight. That'll feel a little nicer. Tomorrow looks good, too. We'll be dry and clear. High pressure system starts to build as we get into tonight. You can see those showers out there right now. Uh, it's still pretty dreary. They'll start to become more scattered, more spotty as we get into this afternoon. They'll actually move into the west central mountains and uh, become snow. It'll be snowy in the west and east central mountains today through into this evening. Temperature's not too bad out there, though. 40 right now in Boise, 39 in Mountain Home, 40 in Twin Falls. Uh, looking at our clouds and precipitation, really it's just this set of scattered showers right here. And again, it's going to settle in our uh, higher elevations and actually become a pretty clear and nice day as we get into this afternoon. Looking at our temperatures, though, today we're about 10, 11 degrees above average again. We do start to cool down tomorrow. We're in the low 40s. And then it gets a little bit warmer again on Wednesday. And then a cold front moves through on Christmas Eve. Bringing a chance of showers and also bringing some much cooler temperatures. We'll see highs in the 30s, lows in the 20s as we get into Christmas Day and into this weekend. So this is what we're expecting around this afternoon. Finally, a little bit of clearing. It'll stay clear all Tuesday. Looks really nice. Uh, some sunshine even into tomorrow night. Then we get into Wednesday and those we start to see those clouds uh, return as we get into Wednesday afternoon and then those showers appear. So this is Christmas Eve night. Looks like our temperatures are still a little bit too uh, warm to see snow in Boise, but there will be some rain. And then the mountains are going to get a good amount of snow. You can see these he this heavier snow as we get into Stanley and Ketchum. Looks like McCall might be a rain snow mix because our temperatures quite haven't gotten uh, cold enough yet by Wednesday night, but Thursday is going to be a different story. We're definitely expecting uh, some chilly temperatures on Christmas and even into next uh, ne this next weekend. Uh, today in the Treasure Valley, our temperatures again are going to be warm, but it is a windy one out there. Winds will start to build and increase as we get into uh, this afternoon into this evening, especially in the Magic Valley, the eastern Magic Valley, so Shoshone, Burley, has a wind advisory starting at 11 o'clock this morning, ending at 9 p.m. Could see gusts up to about 40, 45 miles per hour. So it might make driving a little bit dangerous if you're in one of those high-profile uh, uh, vehicles. Looks like mid-30s through the Long Valley today. Snow showers expected as we get into this evening as well. Only about an inch expected above 4,500 feet, though. So not a whole lot of snow, but some consistent showers still. 35 is the high in Sun Valley. 30 in Stanley today. Getting really cold as we get into tonight, though. Could see temperatures get into the negatives uh, in Stanley and single digits in Sun Valley. Looking at our extended forecast, that chance of showers is probably the greatest Wednesday night, as you saw on uh, the Futurecast, into Thursday. But it looks like it'll clear, actually, into your Christmas holiday and into Friday. Jillian?